The Kenya Agricultural Value Chain Enterprises, CAVES, whose main focus was to help smallholder farmers, businesses and national and county governments partners to address constraints of up and down the value chain and develop fully functioning competitive value chains have come to an end after it reached more than one million smallholder farmers in the last five years. In a closeout ceremony, project owners urged county governments to continue helping farmers in boosting productivity. Philip Kitani has the details. Apologies for that. I should be having that story in a short while. Of course, uh, it touches on the big issues around the agricultural sector. We now have that story. The Kenya Agricultural Value Chain Enterprise Kevs whose main aim was to increase the productivity and income of smallholder farmers and other actors along the value chain who are working in the dairy, maize and other staples and horticultural sector has seen its five-year project come to an end after touching the lives of more than one million farmers in 22 counties. More than a million and probably a lot more than a million families in Kenya has benefited directly from this project. The program worked with more than 30 government organizations and private sector organizations including the Ministry of Agriculture, Livestock and Fisheries, County Government, Agricultural Sector Development Support Program, Kenya Dairy Board and the Horticultural Competent Authority Structure, Horticultural Crop Development Authority and many more. In all of our assistance, you know, we work very closely with the government of Kenya, the private sector, civil society, all other development partners, and of course, in this case, the most important people of all, the farmers. The project also helped develop smallholder enterprises that combine maize, high-value horticultural crops, and dairy farming to generate wealth, thereby enhancing food security, improving nutrition, and increasing economic opportunities for women, youth, and other vulnerable populations. It also engaged with the private sector as one of the meaningful, comprehensive activities achieved in the last five years. And having witnessed some of the activities in the rural areas, I've gone to CIA, I've gone to Kisumu counties, and I've seen the kind of food processing activities which are going on there, and uh, the assistance of the USAID caves. The project also helped in building the capacity of local organizations by providing hands-on technical, financial and managerial training so that local organizations can continue providing the high quality services to farmers beyond the life of the project. Philip Keitang, KTN News.